dirty. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Literally two days after you see this, season six of Orange is the New Black is coming out. And to celebrate this, I have decided to do a character quiz on who my prison wife would be. I have loads of these character quizzes and scenario quizzes and stuff like that and personality quizzes. So if you want to go and see the rest of them, I will link the playlist of just taking quizzes in the description box below if you enjoy this and you want to see more of these. Without further ado, here is my prison wife. So I have done this before off camera and I got Piper, I know, Piper. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see if I do this again and get the same result or if I do get another one. This is like the final one. This is my prison wife. So I've decided to take this quiz on Magic Quiz and I will link the link to it in the description box below so you can go ahead and play along as well. Please let me know your results in the comment section or you can even do a video response. A prison wife is more than just a romantic partner. They've always got your back. You want your BFF to be someone who is just playing crazy about me, will share their interests with me, takes no bullshit, will always carry a torch for me, drives me crazy but I can't live without and always has my back. I'm gonna say always has my back. It was between takes no bullshit and always has my back. What can you not deal with? Bitterness, possessiveness, sneakiness, bad hygiene, craziness and competitiveness. There's nothing worse than having a best friend or a friend in general where everything you do it feels like a competition and it's so unhealthy and I've dropped so many people because of this. Number three is obviously you're innocent of any crimes but what are you locked up for? This is so good. Illegal download something involving alcohol, assault, I have rage, deal with it, unpaid parking fines, shoplifting books, me. And I was talked into doing something illegal. I'm gonna go with something involving alcohol because when I have alcohol, I think I can do anything and nothing is gonna stop me. Alcohol goes one of two ways for me. I'm either asleep, like by 12 o'clock and everyone else is still partying downstairs, or I'm the person that's keeping everyone awake. Number four, congratulations, you've been granted furlough. What do you do with your time? Head directly to my favorite bistro for some food that's actually edible, spend some time with my sweetheart, take a never ending shower, soak up as much nature as I possibly can, go out and have a good time. Hug the prison walls. Freedom is weird. I'm gonna probably head to my favourite bistro for some food that's actually edible because prison food apparently tastes like shit. I've never been to prison so I wouldn't know. Number five. What would you most likely buy with your commissionary money? Candy, chips, makeup or ramen flavouring? I'm gonna go with chips slash crisps because there's crisps in the icon and I love crisps. <laughs> Where do you go to, you know, ooh, sexy times? <laughs> chapel lol the library my bed a bathroom stall the janitor's closet and the hallway because yolo i would either go library or the janitor's closet i'm gonna go janitor's closet what could you never leave the house without lipstick a book my badass attitude and a cocktail i'm gonna go with a book because i don't actually leave the house without a book most of the time how do you like to live your life on the edge or by the rules I'm going to say by the rules because I like to think that I live on the edge but in reality I do live quite heavily next to the rules. What's your prison job? Kitchen, laundry, groundwork, electrical, library or maintenance? I'm going to go with electrical because why not sizzle do you get angry easily anything can send me into a rage i suppose i do have a bit of a temper it takes a lot but when i snap i really snap sometimes i get angry i don't even know why so yes i get more upset than angry nope i'm pretty even tempered i get quite irritated quite easily but like proper angry angry it takes quite a lot but when i do snap i do so i'm gonna go with that one who's your ultimate celebrity crush we've got rihanna taylor swift angelina jolie or beyonce i'm gonna go with rihanna because whoo Daddy. Love is a many splendid thing. How easy do you fall for someone? If I decide to fall in love with them, then that'll be that. I don't especially believe in love. It's tricky. I need to have a real connection. If there's someone's hot, no time at all. Hard and fast. I fall in love every day with several different people. Well, none of these really fit with me. And I say I need to have a real connection with someone because that infers it takes a long time. It does take me quite a long time. Show me my results. Ah, that was the last question. Ah, like this little wizard guy. It's really cute. I got Piper again. I don't want Piper. Leave me alone. Taylor Swift of Litchfield. I wouldn't say that, but okay. Piper is one of the most innocent inmates. Although a little confused at times, she throws herself fully into her relationship with her wide open arms. Yes, Piper can be a pain in the ass, but you find her antics endearing. I really don't. She can be tough when she wants to be, but only with the help of your badassness. With forgiveness as her greatest virtue, Piper will put down her walls for you and give your relationship everything it deserves. Share your results with your friends. I'd rather not. So you heard it here first. 
first, my prison life is apparently Piper. Not too happy with that, to be honest. But I was kind of expecting it because I got it last time as well, so never mind. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a massive thumbs up and subscribe. This is actually my last video before Vida. So because Vida starts in exactly a week, this will be my very last upload before Vida. There will be a weekly vlog on the 30th of July, is when the Booktubeathon starts. But um, that will be my last upload before actual Vida starts. But this is my last sit down video before Vida starts. And I am so excited for you to see what I've come up with in Vida. Please go down there and subscribe because I have 31 videos about to go live for you. Some of them pre recorded, some of them not. Four of them are weekly vlogs, but we'll get to it in the introduction. Thank you so much for watching. As I said earlier, there will be a whole playlist in the description box below of all the character quizzes and scenario quizzes and like personality quizzes that I've done. So that will be down there if you want to go and see the rest of them that I've done. If you've exceptionally enjoyed this video, I hope that you really enjoy season six of Orange is the New Black. I know I will be binging it on Friday and I hope you will too. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you on Monday for my last upload before Vida. One, four, three. Bye!